Hi Rachel, it's Amanda here at Spoken Wheel Chicago and our city's most popular haircut is the shag. The shag is a haircut characterized by soft layers that create natural movement. It is an effortless style that lots of women can wear. I'm just refining her fringe. A little bit shorter, but keep it on the longer side so it's versatile for her lifestyle. The face framing layering is going to help create that shape of the shaft by opening up her face and creating soft movement. The final part of the haircut is the refinement. This allows us to customize the haircut for the individual. The great thing about cutting dry is that she will be able to wear her hair smooth and straight or with weight and texture. Hey Rachel, it's Sally. I'm here in my LA salon. The most popular hairstyle right now in LA is the modern mullet. The modern mullet really is the disconnection between the front and the back. What's so great about the modern mullet? It works on all shape bases. You can be a man, a woman, short, tall, curly hair, straight hair. It's so versatile. Finally, Cyrus, she's doing all the cool shows with the cool mullet, and who doesn't want to look cool in LA? Hi, Rachel. This is Janet St. Paul here in Austin, Texas. I own Janet St. Paul Studio for Hair, and we're going to share one of our favorite looks with you, the textured lob. This haircut the length line doesn't need to be exactly precision cut. So I'm just gonna literally nick the ends so that they feel fresh. I keep this little corner in the front because that's what helps it to be a lob. So I come underneath and I start opening it up. You can already see by releasing the weight, it helps the hair to pull up a little bit and have the realization of its own natural texture. I don't curl the root and I don't curl the ends. I just hold it for a minute. I pull straight down. This helps to stretch some of the wave out and help it look a little more beachy instead of too tight and curly. What I love about this is the body. Can you see all the texture, all the bounce, all the movement? I love it. I am so excited. Oh, good. Thank you so much. It's perfect. It's fabulous. In New York City is very interesting. In New York, we like bold sort of crisp looks and this look is very different it's a blunt bob and we actually have a viewer named ashley we have ashley standing behind a television of yeah, uh, with of an herself. image of her former <laughs> self which is weird yeah. ashley a very good nature yeah um so ashley is a beautiful girl very long hair yeah so she took a really bold move here. she yeah we gave her a blunt bob this is a completely different look from the two other previous looks which were all about texture ashley come over come here on it's out. creepy seeing you come on out yeah there, come on out ashley. Yeah. 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 come sit here <laughs> been standing there behind a television oh that's <laughs> perfect actually this is beautiful Isn't do you like great? this haircut on i yourself? love it i think it's so bold and fun <laughs> well it also frames your face so beautifully Thank well you, that's yeah. what's great about a bob a it's classic very sophisticated yeah you look like a, a young lady but you look like a teenager in that picture now you look like a sophisticated city lady. Uh, uh, yeah. new yorker yeah, yeah. For, a bob is all about the line it, it's about architecture, just like New York City here. You can see mm -hmm. better on this side. It's about that strong line which creates shape. And what I love about a bob, especially for people with fine hair, it's a perfect haircut for women with fine hair. I get questions all the time. Mm -hmm. I have fine hair. What do I do? The bob is your cut. It's the cut. Yeah, right. because it had this line, it creates so much structure that it can hold the fine hair and doesn't have all the flyaways. Right, and it's hard to get a successful bob if you have kind of crazy wild all, hair. All over right? the place hair. It's just... And then just in terms of styling, with the previous cuts we looked at, you want paste and clay, all that texturizing, yummy, yummy mm -hmm. product. For something like a bob, I would go with a really soft mousse or a very, very light liquid gel. Just a very, very just light to keep hold. a little control. A little bit there. of control yeah. for the flyaways because the structure is in the cut. That's really the point of the bob. The structure is in the cut. So Here. Don from Donka Ponka gave Ashley this amazing blunt I bob. I just love saying Donka Ponka. It's a great salon here Donka in the city. Donka. Yeah. <laughs>